Hello. I wanted to talk to you today about these uh, Lexol leather deep conditioner. They have uh, a deep conditioner and they also have a deep cleaner. Uh, when I went to the store, I asked the guy, hey, what's the difference? And he said, I'm not sure. The, the deep conditioner cleans and the deep cleaner conditions. So they're pretty much the same. He told me or recommended to get the deep conditioner. So that's what I got. And I'm actually pretty happy with this uh, purchase. It actually does um, really bring like the, the leather to be softer um, and really moisturizes pretty, pretty well. To talk about it, I'm going to bring this book here, which is a English laundry boot. Um, and actually it's, um, it's a pretty low quality leather, so it's pretty, pretty hard. I would think that this is, it doesn't say, but I would imagine that this is genuine leather, which is the lowest kind. Um, I only got it because I was going to get charged $40 shipping for another purchase. Um, but this boot was on sale for $55. So, and it was going to save me the $40 shipping. So I figured, Hey, a boot for $15 that that's okay. So the leather is pretty, pretty hard. And the first time that I wore it, I got a huge blister on my ankle because this thing was pretty, pretty tough. Um, so I used the conditioner, um, and it softened it, softened it quite a bit, um, made it a lot more pliable. Um, it also darkened it. This darkens. I don't know if you can see the difference here, uh, that this looks a little lighter here. I actually missed this spot a little bit. So I'm going to go back with the conditioner and hit that area. Actually, I'm going to hit the whole shoe but I'm going to make sure not to miss that. Um, but the color, even after it's darkened, is very nice, uh, very even. Um, so I really like it. I really like the result as far as what it does to, to the leather. Um, I also have another shoe. Um, these are a pair of uh, Johnston Murphys. And I really like these shoes. And... They're 16 years old, so they need to be conditioned. Um, so I use the uh, Lexol conditioner on this shoe. It actually darkened it also. It gave it like a, a little reddish color for a few weeks. That has kind of subsided and gone back to the brown color that it naturally was. Uh, but for a while, it had these little reddish hue that I actually liked quite a bit. Um, and I like how it makes the uh, leather uh, feel after after you apply it. And whatever shine you see here, um, even though I, I maintain these shoes quite a bit, I have not uh, polished the shoe after I applied the conditioner. I basically just applied the conditioner, um, let it stay on the shoe overnight, and then I just buffed it. Um, just buff it and then go with the um, with a cloth and that's the shine that you see here uh, so it's pretty good pretty good maintenance for your shoe I really like it and I recommend it it's uh, pretty inexpensive so if you're looking for something to maintain your shoes these uh, Lexor Lexol leather conditioner is a pretty good option. Okay, thanks.